So I'm going to show you how I made this um, mini album using a pack of these Kaiser Craft cards and envelopes. Um, there's six in a pack, so there's six cards and there's six envelopes, and I made this whole book using um, just one pack of those plus pattern paper and stuff. And um, inside you have these little pockets that you can stick tags in. And the tags I used were from the Tim Holtz uh, die. And then we've got these little pockets for some smaller tags. And they're just the number five size tags. So I'll just take you through the book a little bit. And there's another little area for photos. I didn't decorate it too much because um, I wanted to just basically show you how to put the book together and decorating it you can decide for yourself how you want to decorate it. There's lots of room for photos and journaling and all sorts of things like that. So, And it basically goes the same throughout the whole book. So um, we'll get started. So to start, you're going to take all the envelopes out of your package and you're going to seal them all and then put one aside and we're going to take the five remaining envelopes and we're just going to trim off that top edge just like so. And then what you're going to do so that that opens it up again, but then you don't have the flap. So then you're going to fold all five envelopes in half, just like so. And I've already pre-folded all of my envelopes, so, so you have five envelopes and then you have your six cards. And then with the remaining envelope, again, you seal it up, and then you're going to trim off all the edges, and these are going to get cut into one inch strips. So I'll just do that. So they're, so they're going to look like strips like this. And you want to cut it along the long side like this so that they're the shorter pieces, I guess, if that makes any sense. So we're just going to trim all of these. To one inch strips. And these are going to form your binding pieces. So you should get six strips per side with a total of, of 12 strips. Okay, and then these strips you are going to fold them the long way in half so that you've got this little hinge. So do that to all of them. So I've got all my strips folded and one thing I forgot to mention on the part where where like the back side of the envelope where it's not smooth and you've sealed the thing, just go ahead and glue the loose pieces. Like you'll have a piece that's got kind of like a little flap like that. Just go ahead and glue it so that it's just one solid piece. Okay, and then we can start assembling our book. So you're going to take one of the cards and just have it the way you will have your book opening. I'm kind of working upside down here. So, so if I take this, then I'm going to take an envelope piece and this one you want to make sure that your open edge is facing the top, whatever your top is, and you're going to um, attach one of your binding strips that are folded with the valley side in. Um, 
it's kind of handy because these strips match exactly the folded envelopes so so you don't have to measure and get it right so so then we're just going to attach one of these to the envelope and then we're going to kind of center where we want it to go cuz I want my I want these to go kind of in the middle, but you could do them at the bottom or whatever, but I like them in the middle because it just adds more stability at the end. So then you're just going to glue the other flap and then you're just going to center, making sure that your opening is at the top. And then you're just going to adhere it. This is such an easy book to put together and it's really fast if you have all your supplies cut ahead of time this is super quick so then we've got our first we've got our cover and then the first page your second page and just like that so we're going to continue so we take another strip and glue it to our envelope piece matching the folded edge to the edge of the envelope and you can use any strong glue like you can use the two-sided tape as long as it's strong and it'll hold so we've got our next hinge so we're going to take our next card and we're going to adhere that to our hinge Make sure your openings are going the same direction. And then we're just going to make sure that they line up together, the two cards, sides, just like so, so that the edges are exactly where you want them to be. So, and then we'll just come in here and glue it. And we're going to be covering this up, so don't worry if you get glue on the side. And then we're just going to continue, take our next envelope, make sure that the opening is on the top side, and attach our hinge to the envelope. I always do the, to the envelope first because then I can see where it needs to go. that and then we're going to to match up our envelopes we're just going to turn this on its side and then you can see I'm going to make sure I go in the right direction here Oops. so yeah my envelope's going to go here and then I can see where my last envelope is so I'm just going to match that up as best as I can. You're not going to notice it too much if it's a little bit off, but it'll be very close. So there's our second envelope page. And then we're just going to continue um, adding our hinges and alternating our cards and envelopes. Okay, and then the last card. 
card. Just like so. So if you've used wet glue, like I have, then you're just gonna let this dry till it's completely dry. So we've got our front cover, and then we've got all our little pages. Super fast, super simple to assemble this book. So next we will um, put the paper on.